Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to resolve common backup issues you're experiencing on your Windows 11 computer. So if you're unable to backup your computer or unable to restore from a backup, in today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to hopefully resolve it without too much of a hassle. And we're going to go ahead and jump straight into it. So first thing we're going to do is open up the search menu and search for services. Best match to come back with services. Go ahead and open that up. And the first service you want to look for is the remote procedure call service. Right here, double click on it. And you want to make sure startup type is set to automatic and the service status is running. If not, you want to make those changes and then select apply and OK. Next thing you want to do is go down to the RCP endpoint manager, double click on it. Again, make sure startup type is automatic and that it is running and you want to click on start and change the startup type to automatic respectfully. If you need to make any such changes in here, then you would select OK. And then finally, you want to locate the Windows backup service. So right here, go ahead and double click on that. If service status is stopped, you want to go ahead and start the service. You do not need to set it to automatic. Manual is fine. Go ahead and select OK. And once you know with that, go ahead and open up the search menu. Type in File Explorer. Best match, come back with File Explorer. Go ahead and open that up. Select this PC on the left side. And then right click on your drive that you're having the problem with with the backup. And select Properties. You want to select the Tools tab. And then error checking. This option will check the drive for file system errors. Go ahead and select check. Select the scan drive and give it a moment here. Okay, so once that's done, close out of here. Select OK, close out of here. Open up the search menu again and type in CMD. Best result should come back with command prompt. Right click on it and select run as administrator. If you receive a user account control prompt, select yes. And now you want to go ahead and type in SFC followed by a space forward slash scan now. Scan now should all be one word attached to that forward slash out front. Go ahead and hit enter on your keyboard to begin the scan.
Okay, so once that sound close out of here and restart your computer. Okay, so that should hopefully have been about it, guys. So as always, thank you guys for watching this brief tutorial. Do buzz able to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.